Hi everybody, welcome to another episode of Fish Keeping Jumping. Hi. Welcome to Today I am talking about the whole idea of um, time management. Now, uh, I don't know how many of you actually watch the analytics or look at the analytics in your, at your YouTube columns, right? But I have a set time frame in which I would like all my videos to be watched, which is about uh, at least if I do a six minutes video at least I want most persons to watch at least four minutes of it that would be good right the thing about it is that uh, you have to create videos that will get the individual's interest what I find is that a lot of persons are doing topics that are just relevant for the moment a week uh, probably a couple of hours and after that the, the video practically become obsolete it, it, it has it adds no value to the fish keeping experience in which others may have so my advice to persons out there is that you try as best as possible to concentrate uh, your effort on creating videos along the timeline the timestamp in which the analytics suggest that persons are more likely to watch so therefore if persons are more likely to watch a uh, two-minute video on your channel do two minute videos right um let individuals advise you that they would like to ha have more of this yes i do have long videos long videos more time is um unavoidable because i i realize that persons don't like videos in parts like part one part two part part three right but I also realize that persons don't like anything over four minutes. And that's one of the reasons why I started to use um, narrated videos. Because narrated videos, I can just write my ideas down in two paragraphs and tell the truth. Each time when I'm trying to do dialogue video, I try to I, I, I tend to go off on a tangent by using different examples. And as a result of like that, I find that dialogue videos for me tends to be a little more lengthy right narrative videos kind of help me to get to the point and i find myself being able to put in a little bit you know clips in there so as to get the video to be you know at least you can see what i'm saying right so that's a particular issue having as as a as a, as a fish tuber a person who is not really active online uh that popular online i think it's really very difficult or should i say it's very dangerous uh to have videos that are 15 20 25 minutes long and that's one of the reasons why i'm not really up to the streaming right um i did streaming for a bit but uh to me it's all uh, right listen this when i do stream videos right I would be on for like say 60 minutes and on the 60 minutes i would have like probably about 60 odd um viewers right but after 60 odd viewers i would have average watch time of roughly 10 minutes right and when you couple that with the fact that persons may see the stream topic see the stream uh thumbnail and want to actually visit the channel to watch this um, past stream you realize that that is like very very slim so i practice the whole idea of um, doing videos that persons will actually you know wants to to hear about uh not necessarily now uh well when i say not necessarily no i mean that uh, you will have a flood of viewers coming in at one time and then it finish right but my videos over time it will continuously be time relevant well, this is another video from me, Rally. I hope that this video was interesting. Stay with me. I have one more video in my series of uh, your channel spot. Alright, cool. Catch me next time. Bye.